Hello everyone, welcome back to let's uh another Harvest Moon update. Yeah, I am I'm pretty 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 close together, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, probably. Anyways, uh, I told you guys there would be another one coming up here pretty soon. This time, oh this time. <laughs> yeah, we have a big enough Vimery Vimery card. You on that one? No, that's not okay. No Shit. Um Damn. No shit. Sorry, I keep doing things <laughs> incorrectly. Usually it would want you to create memories. But apparently no, not this time. I got, I got a few things to talk about. Um this time. That we can save the game. I told you we we're gonna watch the intro, it was up in the air. Looks like we're doing it. But whilst this is going on, and hopefully this music doesn't overpower me too much. Um I'm just gonna go ahead and talk about some of the questions that are gonna be asked throughout the uh part here. I'll remind you at the end if I can remember. First off, um, let me know if you guys want a house in the Minecraft that up episodes. I already got a request for that uh, the <laughs> noises for Rock Paper Mario. Um, want some made about my house. Anybody else? Just go say, hey yo, I want a house. That could be a special house, but I'm gonna somehow. I, kn I know what you guys are thinking. You guys are like, oh, this is gonna be boring. It's just some guy with a house, and it's gonna be on some random guy's map, and we're gonna see it on YouTube. But I'm gonna make it more interactive. Trust me. I'm gonna make it more personalized as I go on. So, um, like for instance, if you have a YouTube channel, like obviously you will. <laughs> if you have, if you're a Let's Play channel or a vlog channel or whatever, you don't have to be necessarily a Let's Player. I can put like a sign in your house that goes to your well, not necessarily goes to, but it has the link or the YouTube channel name or something or your current let's plays that you've done or some, some way to make it personalized and I will make it a little bit more interactive as I go another question is, is wondering if you guys want me to make a video of my recording setup I have both Mac and Windows right now my Windows one isn't working yet <laughs> I got both computers set up and they're running off the same outlet I'm a little worried about it but um, I don't think they'll hurt anything hurt anything as long as they don't exceed 20 amps Oh, what else was I gonna ask? Hmm. Oh, I also I'll get to that later. That's something I'll ask later as I'll interrupt myself. But um, this is the food storage. You put dairy products in here, and I'll take it to the market because you two fucking things. I got nothing else to do. Oh, jeez. Can everybody sick of this place? It's just a wonderful life. It is here in uh, Harvest Moon. Get to watch the old intro again. You guys can never get sick of this. Only this time we're gonna be saving it. This never gave me a name for the dog or the horn or anything, so I'm probably just gonna give him. Uh, I'm I don't know. I kind of like the name I used last time, so my dog's name's gonna be Sex Face again. Okay. Yes, Sex Face. It's great. It's amazing. Don't ask questions. Do you want the creep one? No. Uh, oh, you're gonna say yes. My dog actually like pooped in my house. Like I was gone for 20 minutes. I had to go walk and pay the. Uh, Get money out of the ATM, get a money order, and uh, pay off my rent. And the asshole pooped in my house while I wasn't here. Um, I ate him. He's now dead. So my next dog will definitely be named Sex Face in real life. Of course, I'm joking. I didn't eat him. I sold him to a Mexican to eat. That's terrible. What the hell's wrong with me? What the hell is wrong? I usually go with the floppy ears, but today we're gonna go pointy, 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 pointy. <laughs> Also, if you guys are interested in the uh, Minecraft server, ooh, 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 I want to talk about that. Yes, Minecraft server. Um, I got one. That's said. No, I mean, uh, Jesus, this intro is long. I got a Minecraft server that will be put back up here pretty soon. Um, it's it just kind of needs to be set up, and that's kind of a huge pain in the ass. But I'm gonna try to get it set up, and you guys will be able to, you know, jump into the. Um, the server, you know, yeah. And the cool part is, is I will be flipping out the maps, uh, depending on whichever you guys want to see, I guess. Uh, the, the Temple Lands map that I'm using in my Let's Play will probably be on there. Um, I'm going to make a copy of it, and I will put it up there. It'll probably be the most common um, one up there. Another one I'm going to have up is the Brofist Empire, which is something me and Awesome Solves or Alan made quite a while ago. I think I still have it, and I think it's still working. Um, it didn't get map cancer, which is, um, 
a pain in the ass. If you ever had map cancer, um, it sucks. Let's see here. Hmm. Do 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 do. Map map cancer. Map cancer was interesting. I don't remember if anybody's ever had map cancer. Uh, but basically what happens is it's like. Whenever you spawn back in, for some weird ass reason, all these huge mountains or like hills go all over the place. And like, there was one that spawned like right near our spawn point. And it sh every time you logged in, a fountain of sheep would come out the top of it. It was weird. And there was this mountain in the middle that you couldn't get rid of. It was, I think it was a spawn bug, and it broke the map. So, Pox Bomb is a happy cow. He's a happy cow, Pox Bomb. <laughs> that ain't funny. That ain't funny. Yeah. I give a name this farm. Um. Hmm. But yeah. Um. The Minecraft. Store, I don't really have a set date for it. I also might have just a regular old. Uh, um. Um. I might have a regular old map just for anybody to play. Um. No, <laughs> I was gonna put something ew. Ugly man. That's gonna be the name of my farm, Ugly Man Farm. It's got an ugly man in it. He's not gonna know who I'm talking about though. Eyebrow guy. He's not that ugly. Ugly man farm, huh? Ugly man. Ugly. Anyways. Uh so yeah, those are the three questions. Just let's spit them out now. Just for fun. I'll probably forget before the end. Introduce myself. I think last time I played, I was cough. Oh yeah, I was cough. I was like, "How's it doing?" <coughs> it's so funny. It's so funny. Hi, Aipu. Aipu was the last one, right? Okay. How about um? How about how about something vulgar? Why not? I'm in a vulgar mood. Hi, lick me. Lick me is a good name. There's no space, so we're just gonna put differentiate by a by a by is a word by a caps and put in a question mark. Lick me. There we go. Let's see what this chick has to say. Or guy. Lick me. Got it. <laughs> anyway, cherryum diddly dip. If I could fit it in there, that would be the name of my farm. I hope you guys enjoyed the Brofist uh, episode of. Um, Last or the finale of the bro fist of um, things. What was it? Ugh. Sonic 3 and Knuckles. That was fun. Painful, but fun. We haven't picked out a new one yet, so if you guys want to see something. I think we had a suggestion for another Mario title. It's possible. I don't see why not. I don't know which one we'd play, though. Maybe. S I want to play Mario Brothers 3, but. It's up in the air. Noises. Here's Muffy. What a dumb name for a girl, I'm sorry. If I never met a girl named Muffy, I'd be happy. I'm kidding. If there's anybody watching named Muffy, I'm, I'm joking. Muffy just sounds like a... Like a car part. For a really gay car. But anyway. Oh no, you broke your Muffy. Ah, th see there's Celia. I don't remember if it showed her or not, but I did. She's a brunette. Celia, that's the one I usually marry. She's easy to get in her pants, so. Oh god, that's terrible. Of course, it doesn't show Nami. Nami's the emo chick. So, <laughs> I'm not. I'm a nice person, but um, yeah. I'm actually. Oh right. Let's put Fom done. Let's get some Fom done. Ah, oh, so pretty. Oh, it's a wonderful life, guys. It is. There's somebody out there with a. The with a weed eater or a leaf blower or some shit going on. That's great. Can I play the game now, you douche? You must be tired of me talking. For an old guy, this guy sure can talk a lot and it's almost evening. Wow, you just talked the whole day away, didn't you? <gasps> you didn't have a lot of friends, so that's probably why he spends his time talking to uh, Mr. Uh, Lick Me. So. That's an interesting name. Who is it? Who is it? I don't know. Already doing this dialogue. Dialogue. Harvest sprites. Eat them. Their food. Their food. Eat. Lick me. You should eat them. Lick me. I'm just gonna call him that. I'm gonna lick me. I'm just. I'm, I'm, that's how I'm gonna say his name. 
How does it go? Nice to meet you. Lick me. <laughs> this is so funny. Oh my god. Titties. Anyway, uh, what else was I gonna talk about? Ooh, I got plenty of Kirby recorded. Um, some of it's kind of late. Well, no, it's not really late. The South Park, I think, is uh, build for kill. Building a kingdom for kill. Building. A Let's build a kingdom for Keflings is uh, still in the works. I think I have one more episode left, but um, I had to do this first because I think I mentioned. I don't remember why I waited so long on it, but um, I started to cheat in uh, South Park there. If you guys hadn't already noticed that, or if it hadn't come up yet. As you saw in part eight, it is uh, painful, and it gets better when I get cheats, but only slightly. Progress would never be made. I, that's pretty much what I uh, decided. Uh, words don't. Dis words can't do it. Words just don't describe the pure frustration that that game invokes makes me miss like what is another heart what is like hard body harvest I would damn it that game was pretty frustrating and it had its frustrating points but South Park 64 has just been a super frustration but I have done something to attempt and fix it I went and bought another controller <laughs> smart person I'm a smart guy guys <laughs> buy another controller that's real smart and then I bought a memory card at a uh, game exchange with a decent price for some reason, and I don't quite understand why, but, um, okay, Game Exchange is a little weird. Like, okay, the back, okay, they used the tag that was on the front of the memory card that was labeled $7.95. If you look in the back, there's another price tag for $14.99. I got it for $7.95, luckily, but bitches wake up. There we go. And they're, they're pooping. They're pooping. Nah, it's gross. Let's leave. There's no one in here. Um, where the f oh I thought that was Celia gee Celia you sure got what's that say must have been here for a long time it's pretty effective too I see no crows whatsoever they're really starting to crow on me that's what I'd say if I was a scarecrow and like the scarecrows like if if the crows like landed on me and I was a scarecrow I'd be like they're really starting to crow on me ah uh, when I was a child they used to live in the town of Vesta Burn. by the way guys let me know who you think I should marry yes we're just gonna buy some tomatoes because um, why not? You already have two, so we're gonna top it off at twenty. This time we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna really buy some shit. Yeah, is this okay? Yeah, are you sure? Whatever. Bonus round, by the way, guys. Damn, I'm talking too damn fast. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about anymore. Uh, oh, that's a shame. <laughs> Second, guys, I'm gonna be text some. Well, so in nothing moving, that's why. Um, right, I got a new controller, so I hope it works. But the thing is, I think it's got it's got sound the same make, but different. It looks exactly the same as the retro bit, but it's called a Yobo. And the guys are like, it uses the same. Uh, uh, um, it uses the same kind of control stick technology that the PS3 uses, and that worries me. Then again, I didn't know what the technology the other one used, so... Jesus, I think I might be leaving. Hmm. Anyway. What was I saying? Um... I don't remember. Oh yeah, right. Controllers. So I'm gonna give that a shot next part. Uh, you guys won't see that until I think, like, part 10? I think? Maybe 11. But let me know who you think I should marry. Um, also... There's a, something I've been wanting to talk about. Um, like, I am a big fan of not just any individual L player, uh, Let's player, but I'm just a big fan of the community in general. And I've been trying to figure out some way how to outreach to those who, you know, who Let's Play, but, you know, haven't been, haven't been heard of yet. You know what I mean? Like... Like psychotic LPs, and I, I, I haven't read. A lot of people aren't gonna know who those are, who they are, who they, who those are. Um, but they're basically what I think gave us our first little sub push. And I don't think it's necessarily because of the sub, but it's it's first. It was what first helped us getting you know 
some sort of recognition in the opening thing, and I've been trying to figure out a way how to do that. Um, give me a hoe, bitch. I need a, I don't need a hoe, bitch. I need that bucket. But I've been trying to figure out, like, if any, like, I've been going out, and I've been look, re looking at other people's, like, uh, Let's Plays, and I'm trying to see, what do you guys think of me, like, doing a spot for them, you know? Like, uh, like, okay, for instance, I keep waiting for a bubble over my head for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> God, no, d no, you, f you f fucker, go. Um, let's go milk a cow or some shit. For example, um, through usually people discover different LPers through other LPers, and I discovered an LPer. Get the f you fat cow, pox bomb. Um, I discovered an LPer named Eight S Black through Classic Sega Summer, who did an LP of a game. Uh, called Joan Mac, which I think was fantastic. Uh, I definitely encourage you to go check out his channel. Um, but he did a really cool LP, and I always thought, like, hey, you know, why not do a spot in order just to show him off to other people? Because some people have noticed him or something like that. Then again, there are some people that, who are, uh, you know, her let's players that, again, haven't quite been noticed yet. I'm looking for more people to sub to, so. Hey, why not? If if you're an out let's player and you're like, hey, check out my let's plays, I'll be more than happy to, you know. Um. So, if you guys would like, because I already gave up the whole. I gave I sort of didn't give up the idea, but I thought of an idea like of giving you guys advice. Like I'm the guru of let's plays. I'm not trying to be, but just in general advice of what I've learned through let's playing. In order t for you, you know, just to give you guys a heads up, or if you guys want to take his input, a lot of people don't like the criticism. But if some people, or not criticism, but advice, and s but some people do, they let me know, and I will, um, and I will try to do that. But um, probably, I would probably do that in a whole separate video thing. If I ever did do like an LP or spotlight thing, it would be associated with the wrap up, um, which we haven't done in a while, and I think that's because. Um, it's a pain in the ass. I keep <laughs> expecting my farm to get like disappear. I'm planning on making one, but I'm waiting for another feature. And me and Alan were talking about something uh, when it came to the uh, feature, as far as like uh, associating the community. But um, we haven't really figured something quite. We think of doing like doing a news deal or something. That actually I thought was cool. I thought that was really neat. I really liked that idea. And unfortunately, like our wrap ups are sitting like you know, two or f you know two or three minutes. And I was thinking of adding in a, like an LP of the week type of spotlight thing. I'd have to sort of run it by them. And um, but yeah, I think if there's somebody out there who's really passionate about LPing and are just having doing it for ton, you know, because it's tons of fun. And and I just put all my shit in the wrong area. Hell yeah. And but you know, just haven't quite gotten that recognition or if you if you like sub to me or if, if you're saying this for somebody else whatever read Kyle you dumb bitch uh, let me know and I'll and we might do a spot with you sometime I don't know when the next wrap-up would be unfortunately but um, it would be sometime soon anyways guys I'd like to thank everybody for watching uh, let's uh, update and Harvest moon a wonderful life part 5 motherfuckers did I just hear a boring noise uh, no it was me jumping boring that's what I do all day. That's what Lick Me does all day. He just boinks. But anyways, guys, I'd like to thank again. I'd like to thank everybody for watching. Uh, remember, if you'd like a house on Minecraft it up, let me know. If you would like a video of me showing off the recording setup, also let me know. And if you like the, if you're a new out Let's Player and you're just starting out and you need some advice, or if you want me to check out your channel, let me know. Cause, you know, I'm 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 really interested in trying to get to know some more peeps through this wonderful community known as the Let's Players, so thank everybody for the third time for watching me and Lick Me and Sex Face. See you on the screen. Appropriate names, definitely. And I will see you guys next time.